Happening now, Vail is extending its season by another week. A lot of folks enjoy the slopes today and, of course, the annual pond skimming championships. Ah, but you'll have to wait until next year to ski at Keystone. The mountain closes for the season today. CBS4's Matt Kroschel is live at Keystone. And, Matt, you caught up with people squeezing in those final runs. And it was a gorgeous day out here today. We have sunshine and just wonderful conditions for the final day here at Keystone. They shut those lifts down right after 4 o'clock, and this place is a ghost town. It will be this way for the next couple of months, but people are already looking ahead to next ski season. <laughs> Sun's out, guns out. <laughs> the saying goes, all good things must come to an end. It's beautiful. I wish it wasn't closing. The mountain's fully covered. Ready for another month. It is. It's always a little bit bittersweet at this time, but it was a great season. Everyone enjoyed themselves. And as employees around here start closing things down for the winter, they're already looking ahead to this yeah, summer. So we have downhill mountain biking, scenic gondola rides, hiking. This is the snowiest season at Keystone within the last five years. Great conditions, great fun. Several of the restaurants here in the village also closing down for a few months to make repairs. They're already uh, out of food out here. We just tried to get some dinner and no food left. Everyone's been eating it all. <laughs> We're live here at Keystone. Matt Croshill, CBS4 Mountain Newsroom. Somebody will feed you. All right, thank you, Matt.